Welcome to Germany is about a family, um, a somewhat wealthy family, bourgeois family that has a lot of problems but doesn't face the problems that kind of underneath. And one day, at, at one day, um, the mother decides to invite a refugee, an African refugee, into their homes in midst the refugee crisis, the migration crisis. And it was supposed to be a small film, but it became kind of a meta metaphor for Germany. I, guess. I always, or I often see the world in, in comedic ways or in uh, ways that are close to, to my sense of humor. I think it's, uh, it doesn't mean that something, just because something is funny or a film can be funny or comedic doesn't mean it doesn't treat its issue without seriousness, you know. I think uh, the best comedies are based on very serious um, situations, sometimes in private life, sometimes even big, big political issues. But to me, comedies are very serious movies, and they can be very emotional, emotionally engaging and touching and accessible for people, even with very difficult, complex themes. I think it's easier for people to feel certain truths about, about uh, you know, difficult themes when they watch a comedy. I think it became so successful because it's really an honest film, I think. It's very unfiltered. It's not politically correct, um, but it's also not in any way um, sarcastic or mean-spirited. It treats the issue of the migration crisis, uh, you know, with dignity and emotion. I think, you know, just in a, in a humanistic way. You know, about, it's about a family trying to help. But it also shows the difficulties and the challenges, and even raises questions like critical questions about a certain conservative aspects of Islam. You know, even, and these are things that I think are much more courageous than uh, than other things in the movie. That it tries to, you know. Uh, show different perspectives on of, the, of this very complex um, situation, and I think that resonated. I think people went in there and they thought, "Oh, maybe I'm going to get a, a, di a message thrown at me, a one-dimensional message." And instead, what they saw on screen was, I think, was discussion, and it was different perspectives. And I think a lot of people could find themselves within certain aspects of all this discussion. A lot of people didn't have their opinion firm yet, and the movie also doesn't have one opinion. It kind of searches for solutions and opinions, and I think that's, that's the reason why it became so successful. And it's very funny.